name is Jesse Kitai. I play guitar in the Muir. And I'm here today with Ivan to check out the new uh, RGD. So I contacted my guy at Ibanez because uh, I wanted to get a seven string. He was like, let's uh, you know try the new model coming out, the RGD, take a look at that. Now here I am checking it out. Really excited about it and excited to get my own. You know, this is as metal as a guitar can get and it has uh, you know the curves of an RG as well as a little bit of uh, a little bit of a new touch, a little bit of like a horn type of thing, which looks cool. And then you got the uh, the top, which is like in a, the S series, which is a little bit thinner up top, more comfortable. Uh, look at the bevel right there. But it feels good when you wear it low and you got the neck up a little bit. You definitely hear all your notes. You're not you know down here or all over the place. Pretty much where you need to be with this guitar. So this guy, the RGD, has a really nice cut. We can get up there real high and have no problems at all. Having a 26 and a half inch neck is awesome. It's much better for the low tuning, easy to stay in tune. Uh, you don't have to go, you know, putting 70s on there or 68s. I could use thinner strings on there because of the actual design of the guitar. I have to get some harder bends in there. I like the position of the switch on the RGD Maybe because if you're just jamming out and you want to go ahead and get into the high register and do some lead and stuff, you could just hit it right up and then get back into it. No problem, back and forth. Everything, uh, it seems super individual, all the, the wood all the way around and pretty much every angle that I've seen so far uh, on this guitar has been very, very consistent. So. Craftsmanship is very, very good for this guy. Yeah, the playability on this guitar absolutely um, is is better than any other seven string that I've used, which is super, super exciting because it's going to come factory, and any anybody out there is going to be able to grab this guitar, which is ready to go. You know, ready to go riff, and you go plug it in to a couple of pedals. You know, your favorite pedals. Plug it into your favorite amp and cab, and uh, it's going to rip and roar, man. Yeah.